Hello legends and welcome back to the channel. So we have just returned to the mainland from Tasmania and it was so sick. Our last stop in Tassie was Maidena and <laughs> my dog is snoring. The last stop in Tassie was Maidena, which I think is probably one of the biggest mountain bike parks in Australia. It has so many trails and it's sort of hard to get your head around because there's just so much to choose from. Yeah, sick. Maidena's sick. I didn't get a whole lot of footage, unfortunately. And I snapped another hanger for my derailleur. So I rode Maidena for two days chainless and it was so fun. So this video will be a top to bottom run on those trails that I really enjoyed. Thanks for watching and I'll uh, see you on the next one, hopefully. From the summit, there's only one option, and that's Skyline, a fun, flowy blue trail. That does require a little scoot without a chain. Locals say this trail is responsible for more stacks than any other trail here. Yeah. That's where I crashed. Yeah. I just overshot it, eh? And yeah, that's the one thing I'm not enjoying. Yeah. It's at this intersection where your options start to open up. Head left down tea trees to the west side or right down Pandani to head down the east side. There's a little climb out from the west side, so east it is. Yeah, it's sick. Cut out Summer Pandani, you can slide off to the right and tackle Express Lane. Express Lane is a steep technical double black trail. I enjoyed the top section of Express, but the middle section I couldn't quite figure out, so it's back on Pandani. And we are back at another intersection. I started to learn the top section of Zen Garden. I think the top of Zen isn't too bad, considering it's rated a pro line, but there's a tricky drop down the bottom and I couldn't really get it clean. Oh, I nearly cooked that one. This drop. Yes. Oh, stay high. Oh, <laughs> 
Yeah. From here, I like to drop onto another fun technical trail, the bottom of Sticks and Stones. Now you go, because I, I can't really work this end bit out. I crashed on the steep section down the bottom the day before. I felt like every time I attempted this section, I was rolling the dice. First drop. Nice. Second drop. Third drop. Oi! That's what I did yesterday, dude. You all good? Oh, I went the wrong way. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Wicked yeah. Sticks. And to keep the momentum and the tech going, it's onto Wicked Sticks. I really enjoyed riding these technical trails chainless and trying to hold my momentum without relying on pedaling. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah. Oh, very cool. <laughs> and there's nothing yeah. like dropping onto some flow after all that tech. Spirit Quest has one of my favorite berms out here. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that berm's so good. Yeah. I went to take a pedal. <laughs> oh, nice. And more intersections. This place is a labyrinth, but we are working through it. Funky Cold Medina is the perfect mix of tech and flow. And time for some bulk air. Well, not really. The local is rated a black diamond free ride trail. I really struggled to get these jumps without pedaling, but it's still so good. Yeah, we're good. Yes. Woo! Oh, a little short. And again. Yes. Yes. Woo! A green flow trail. And a tuck down the bottom black jump trail. <laughs> and we are back at the Maydina base. Well, hell, four days in Maydina, and I still had a lot more to explore in this massive mountain bike path. Let me know what your favorite Medina trails are in the comments. Thanks for watching legends. And if you enjoyed the video, please hit that subscribe button. It really helps the channel. Thanks heaps.